sleep with one eye open, pillows, airbag. Taking tests at school, desk is airbag. Riding on a mule, nay, it's an airbag. Let's go! Your mother's an airbag, brother's an airbag, teacher's an airbag, teachers are bad bag. Don't be a drag, embrace the bag. Hating on airbags, red flag. Grandma's an airbag, grandpa's an airbag, cousin's an airbag, big loving airbag. Yo mama bag, yo llama bag, pudge and a bag, bum and a bag. Kidding, I'm an airbag. This is getting ridiculous. Not everything can be an airbag. Sorry, did you say something, Pear? <gasps> I don't want to get surprised by airbags anymore. Sure thing. There's the exit. Wait, what's happening to me? Why do I feel so? Hey, that cloud looks kind of like an airbag. BFFs can finish each other's airbags. Grass is green and one plus one is airbag. I'm sorry to inform you that the lumps on your butt are hemorrhoids. Give it up for our contestants, Orange. Howdy Tony! <laughs> and Pear! Great to be here! Oh, 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 that's not fair! We haven't even started yet! True, but you set your book on the surprise airbag button! Oh, whoops! You see, each of the three buttons before you offers a different prize. One button gives you a mega prize. One button gives you a mini prize. And one button, as Pear already found out, gives the gift of the surprise airbag. Since Pear has already made his round one selection, Orange, it's your turn to choose. Hmm, okay, I want to use my X-ray lifeline. Wait, what? X-ray lifeline initiated. Ooh, nice rocket ship underpants, Pear. Hey! <laughs> well, nice try putting the mini button right in front of me, but I see right through your scheme. <laughs> Orange receives a mega prize of $1,000. What? I didn't know that we got a lifeline. Silly, Pear. Didn't you read the rule book? I didn't know there even was a rule book. <laughs> well, you obviously should have read the book about how there's a rule book. <laughs> <laughs> Round two, Orange, make your selection. Hmm, I'd like to purchase a Test Dummy Lifeline. Test Dummy Lifeline initiated. What? Oh man. Test Dummy, please select the middle button on my behalf. 
Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. If I choose the mega prize, I think I should get half of the- ah! Whoa! Talk about an air fryer! <laughs> Pear, it's your turn to choose. Okay, well obviously I'll take my x-ray lifeline. X-ray lifeline initiated. Nice! Oh man, this thing is handy and- Ooh. Hey, watch where you're watching, perv! Yeesh, sorry. Pear receives the Mega Prize! All right! A Mega Air Bear! What? Ah! <laughs> hey! How's the pear up there? <laughs> Round three! Pear, make your selection! Uh, what does it matter? This game's rigged against me no matter what I do. Plus, I don't have any money to buy a test dummy lifeline. I'll just choose... This one. Pear receives a mega prize of $1,000. Really? Wow, okay, this is awesome. I'd like to use my Sneaky Thief Lifeline. Sneak Thief Lifeline initiated. Orange what? gets all of Pear's money. Woohoo! Well, then I want to use my Sneaky Thief Lifeline. Sneak Thief Lifeline initiated. Pear gets all of Orange's money. Ah, man. Woohoo! Well, I guess all I can do is use my final lifeline, the button burner. Button burner lifeline initiated. Gah! You have burned the mini prize button. Now, make your selection. Ugh, tough break, dude. The only button left is the surprise airbag button. Yeah, not much of a surprise, is it? <laughs> make your selection. Okay, geez, here goes nothing. Um, why is nothing happening? It's a surprise airbag button. That means an airbag is supposed to suddenly blow <laughs> Oh yeah, I'm buying tickets to Pearl Jam. Don't you mean Pear Jam? No, I mean Pearl Jam. Yeah, I think you mean Pear Jam. Pear Jam? Bro, what the heck are you even talking about? <laughs> 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 Hey, Orange, go back in time and drive the Titanic. Hey, hey, sleepy sailor guy, turn left. <gasps> Whoa, thank you so much. You just saved us from hitting that iceberg. Iceberg? What iceberg? I was trying to steer us towards that TNT over there. What the? Oh! <laughs> it's time for S Orange. What kind of car does an egg drive? I don't know. What? A Yolks wagon. <laughs> and you know where it fills up with gas, don't ya? The Shell Station. <laughs> Orange, get ripped. Yeah, all right, here we go. Let's do this. Huh? No, ah, not that kind of rip. Ah! Um. Surprise air! Yeah, I'm gonna stop you right there. See, every time we start doing airbags and dropping stuff, for some reason, I'm always the person it happens to. So here's what we're gonna do. Orange, we're gonna trade spots. What? Come on, me, there, you, here. But nothing painful is gonna happen to you this episode, Pear. I promise. Yeah, well, forgive me for not believing you. But, 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 but. No, but, 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 but's about it. VO guy, please proceed. Surprise airbag! Sorry, Orange, but you have to get up pretty early in the morning to get one past- ah! I tried to tell you! I'm in pain! Congratulations on 11 million! You truly deserve it! Ah, thank you! I still can't believe we have 11 million subs! Yeah, that's a lot of subscribers! No, 11 million subs! No! Okay, when I get out of here, we are switching back. Hey, Orange, what do you call a fly with no wings? What? A walk. <laughs> Hope he doesn't have to walk too far and yell for a cab. He'll be a horse fly. <laughs> Time to turn into marketable plushies. 
Wow, suddenly I feel, wow, like a million bucks. Well, actually just $12.99. <laughs> Only $12.99? What a great deal. Couldn't agree more, but. But what? $12.99 is a fantastic price, and it makes a perfect gift for the holidays. No, but. Huh? No! <laughs> Oh, that's comfy. They're so soft. Become Henry Stickman. Hmm, shouldn't be too hard. Let's just see what we can... Orange, are you okay? I didn't expect it to hurt so much. Say hi, Colton. Hi, Colton. Pear, what? Pear, pear, yes? Pear, pear, pear! What, what, what? Hey, pear! What? Infinite airbags! Ooh, I'm in danger! Poor pear, he can't catch a break. I'll say, thanks for noticing. Well, he can't really catch anything without hands. <laughs> yeah, I could have done without that, thanks. Yeah, probably could have done without this, too. Apologies, I'm so on edge. I, I thought I saw someone burying something over here. Oh, yes, who is me? If I scared you, I'm gravely sorry. <laughs> Orange, what did you bury here? I can't tell you. It's a surprise. <laughs> Dude, we agreed about this. No more surprise airbags. You signed the contract and everything. There, I swear to you, there's no surprise airbag buried here. Oh yeah? Then why does this gravestone say scare bag? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Where where are we? Hmm, looks like we've been taken to the jump scare dimension. What on earth is the jump scare dimension? It's not on earth. It's a different dimension. Remember? <laughs> ah! Orange, get me out of here. What's the matter, Pear? Can't bear it? <laughs> <laughs> Stop laughing and tell me how to leave this place. All right, if you really want to go, just summon another scare bag. To stop being terrified, I have to summon the most terrifying thing of all time? Sorry, but scare bags are the only way to travel within the multi-curse. There's no way I'm ever gonna put myself through that ever again. Yeah! <laughs> okay, I want out. I'll do anything. All right, all you have to do is disturb a scare bag that's lurking nearby. And how would I do that? Be creative. You can disturb a scare bag by stepping on it, or you can insult it by, I don't know, saying something rude about its mother. You can- Fine, fine. Hey, scare bag, uh, your mom's teeth look like oranges. Pear! Sorry, it was the first thing that came to- ah! Ah! Oh, oh, oh. oh, where are we now? Now, but it seems pretty nice. Huh? Ah! Ooh! Ah! 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 Whoa! Knives are everywhere in this dimension, so stay sharp. <laughs> ah! I don't like this dimension, Orange. You sure? To me, it seems like a cut above. <laughs> I want to leave. Okay, then I can't stop you. Uh, hey, Scarebag. Uh, your mom smells like orange's breath. <laughs> really? 
targeting my oral hygiene again? Uh, oh, it's not like I had a lot of time to think up something clever and sensitive. Ah! <laughs> oh, come on. Was it really necessary to fart us out like that? Nah, relax. I'm sure he was just clowning around. <laughs> okay, I do not like this universe. I do not like it at all. We can keep trying new universes if you'd like, but do you really think you're gonna find another one less scary than this? I mean, look how hilarious that one is. <laughs> that is not hilarious or a magic trick. Yes, I want to see other universes right this instant. <sighs> All right, just go easy on my... Scarebags mom bathes less often than Orange brushes his teeth. Would it make you happier if I bought a toothbrush? Yes, Orange. As a matter of fact, it would. <laughs> Ooh, this must be the boogeyman dimension. Emphasis on the boogie. <laughs> Ew. So, do you like it here? No. Wait, did you say no or no's? Because if you ask me, what's snot to like? <laughs> Yo, Scarebag, your mama needs a diet like Orange needs a breath mint. <laughs> Just a friendly reminder that you can disturb the Scarebags in other ways, too. <laughs> Oh, hello. Who did it? Bear, we gotta get out of here. Why? It's not very gross or scary here. Ah! Oh, yo, what you talking about? This place is scarier than Scarebag's mom without her makeup. Ah! Ah! Wow! Now this is what I'm talking about. Don't ask me to leave, Pear. I refuse. <laughs> oh, you refuse, huh? Kind of like how I refuse to date Scarebag's mom. <laughs> okay. Well, at least you didn't dip my teeth that time. <laughs> Look, we can't just keep doing this. We're gonna have to settle on one dimension sooner or later. What about this one? Well, I'm obviously a fan. Well, I guess I could get used to this place too. Look at the size of their joke book selection. Ah, oh, when that settles it, Jubes Library it is. Although, what does Jubes stand for? Jubes? Isn't he the guy who founded Oople? <laughs> har har. Whatever. I'll just look it up. Oh, I see what Jubes is. We're in the jump scares out of books sometimes dimension. Are you serious? Relax, Pear. It's not all the books, just some of the books. See? I guess you're right. Pear, would you quiet down? We're in a library, remember? <laughs> this is terrible. Oh, I know what would cheer you up. A joke. Why did the chicken cross the road? Why? 